Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to install or remove a graphics card. Now for those of you who don't know what a graphics card is, it's an additional video supply for your computer other than the integrated one that usually comes into your motherboard. With your motherboard. So this is what it looks like. And I'm, what I'm doing here is putting a new one in. Now bear with all these wires, I was putting a power supply in and didn't get a chance to tire up them up yet. So I just like to take this four pin out, just cause to get it out of the way. Everything is a mess here. Wow. Alright, so what you want to do is there's this little vice type thing here that holds it all in, as well as your PCI slot accessories. Uh, so just pull that, just turn, there's a screw, or one screw that holds it in. And just take that out. So what you do, uh, there's a pin, oh, I should have to stop. Okay. So, there is a little latch under here. Let's see if I can zoom in on it. I can only do digital zoom. Yep, right there. Right there. This little latch. What you have to do when pulling that out, when taking a graphics card out, is you push it down and just pull the graphics card out. And make sure your graphics, if you're, oh fuck. It's okay. Make sure your graphics card, if your graphics card has any more wires to it, make sure you unplug them as well before taking it out. Nope, I didn't break it. I thought I did. This is a this is a Radeon 5450. So that's what it looks like. So I'm taking that one out. I'm putting this one in. I wish I could zoom out more. I need a new power supply for this one, as I mentioned before in my previous video, that I just actually made. Uh, it needs more power. It's time for me. So this is what it looks like. This is what you would call a no bullshit graphics card. Or as I would call it. So you just have to line it up and pull back that uh, tab again. Actually, you might want to plug in the power for it first, so you don't have to push it around later. The power is this right here. It's a six-pin PCIe card. Just line it up in your slot. Pull your dual tab back. And sometimes when you're installing graphics card, you feel you might be pushing too hard. You're usually not. There's usually something stuck in the way or something you need to do first. So before you go pushing really hard, because sometimes you just need to, uh, before pushing really hard, just make sure nothing's in the way, because that can break something, you don't want to do that. Just make sure there isn't, cause it's... But if, if nothing's in the way and it's not going in, don't be afraid to put a little force on it. Like that. Alright. I'm gonna put back my power supplies, whatever this is for. I'm not sure. I don't know if I can find a way fished around here. That's another thing, when installing components, if you unplug anything, make sure you put it back when you're done. And make sure no wires are in any way of fans or anything like that. 
So I'm gonna clean up the rest of this madness. Oh, before I forget, make sure you put your vise back or whatever you want to call this. And make sure before you close up the back that everything is lined up correctly in there. All the holes with the tabs. Which everything pretty much is. Push forward a little bit. Remember the bottom of the thing is usually you can pull it a little bit to get it where you want it. Just make sure everything's lined up so that you can get to it with a plug. Because sometimes they'll be in there too high or too far back. That should be about that HDMI slot. It's a little far back. Whatever. Yeah. You always want to make sure it's nice and snug. And there you go. Time to install and remove the graphics card.